today not a bad day. Tomorrow umbrellas, well, but okay. you know it's not snow. That's and right. after, yep. hey, nothing is bad after seeing that poor UPS truck. Oh I yeah, mean, I wonder, he was having a rough day. My packages have no. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. uh, all right, let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on. Let's go up to Jack Frost, where there is not a bit of snow on the ground. Um, there was snow uh, on the ground about a week ago, and they were making snow, but right now it's just it's just been too warm. So a lot of the places not dealing with any snow right now. Uh, but hopefully by the end of next week we get cool enough that they can really crank up the old snow machine. Now let's go to Cape May. How about that? Let's go to the beach. Opposite end of our area. Beautiful day down the shore. Blue skies out there. Gentle waves. It's a bit on the chilly side, but it is a pleasant day if you're down the shore and you want to take a walk or a bike ride. Uh, 42 right now in Philadelphia. It's 43 in Atlantic City down the shore, 39 in Allentown. It was a chilly start to the day, so it's a little bit of a slow recovery, but there is a recovery underway. Look at Richmond. We have 50 degrees there. We have 51 in Charleston. We have the winds that have turned to the south and the west, and that is going to ease some warmth into our area for tomorrow. Not so much today, though. Today, we're going to be up around 47 to 49 degrees. In Philadelphia, 50 down the shore, you will get a little bit warmer, and 46 in the Lehigh Valley with increasing clouds. Those clouds will definitely be in place late tonight. We'll drop to 39, but that's going to be early on. Then we'll see temperatures rising on these southerly winds. Look at this gust as high as 20 miles an hour. A spotty shower is possible toward dawn, but I think it does hold off until tomorrow morning. So, what we're tracking next is those clouds increasing tonight. Rain tomorrow, a cooler but a sunny Sunday, and unsettled weather several days next week. Clear Clear skies across the area right now on Storm Scan 3. Clouds are starting to move into the Pittsburgh area. A little disturbance moving through parts of the Ohio and Tennessee Valley. That could bring a spotty shower late tonight. Our high pressure, it's turning the winds to the south and it is easing offshore, making way for our next storm system. This front will come through tomorrow evening. Now, it is producing a lot of snow in the Rockies. It did so in the Sierra. Great for the skiers. We're not going to see snow. We're just going to see rain from this. So here we go. Southerly winds tonight. Clouds in place, 3.30 tomorrow morning, maybe a few sprinkles between 3 and 7. Here we are at 7.30, showers moving through. We start to see this ease off by about, oh, noon, 1 o'clock. We get a break in the afternoon, then the cold front comes through. It's gone. It's offshore by about 7, 8 o'clock. Winds turn to the north and the west for your Sunday. It is going to be a cooler day, but look at this. It is dry at the time that the Eagles are playing. Take a look at the timing for tomorrow. Here we go, the first batch of rain, and then we see just that front moving through, and then things taper off for tomorrow night. Your weekend forecast, 60 tomorrow with periods of rain. It'll be breezy. 47 on Sunday for the Eagles. It will be dry, but it will be breezy as well. We're looking at 49 Monday, 54 Tuesday. Showers there. Showers on Wednesday. Nothing on Thursday, and showers on Friday. Guys, back to you. Oh, boy. Thank you, Tammy. Appreciate it.